The collapsed base knuckle is a common problem. Check to make sure the base is balanced and students are not trying to support the weight of the instrument with the left hand. Frequently ask beginners to reach their arms out and form the C-shaped hand. Students with a lot of tension may play with a raised shoulder. Walk behind students and tap them on the shoulder to remind them to relax. If students get fatigued, they may develop a collapsed elbow where the arm rests on the instrument. The collapsed elbow will lead to other problems like an overly bent wrist, sloped fingers, and incorrect thumb position. Give students plenty of opportunities to rest their left arms so they can maintain a correct arm position when playing. Make sure the end pin is not set too high. If the student has an incorrect thumb placement, it can cause problems with placement of the fingers. The so-called hitchhiker's thumb is fairly common. Students' thumbs come in many different lengths, so there's no one correct placement, but the thumb does need to be placed in a way that allows the wrist to be straight, the fingers to be curved and over the fingerboard, and the hand to be balanced. When the thumb is wrapped completely around the neck, it is almost always because the student is supporting the weight of the instrument with the thumb. Have the student balance the base, reach out with the arm, and form a C-shape with the left hand.